ഹലോ ആൻഡ് വെൽക്കം ടു ശ്രീ വിദ്യാഭാരതി മെട്രിക് ഹയർ സെക്കൻഡറി സ്കൂൾ സക്രാംപാളയം നാമക്കൽ ആൻഡ് വെൽക്കം ടു അവർ ഇംഗ്ലീഷ് ക്ലാസ് സോ സോ ഫാർ വി ഹവ് കംപ്ലീറ്റഡ് യൂണിറ്റ് വൺ ടു ഫോർ പോയം പ്രോസ് ആൻഡ് സപ്ലിമെൻ്ററി ആൻഡ് ബിഫോർ ആർ യൂണിറ്റ് ടെസ്റ്റ് വി ഹവ് കംപ്ലീറ്റഡ് യൂണിറ്റ് വൺ യൂണിറ്റ് ടു vocabulary and grammar and today onwards you have only vocabulary and grammar classes so where we have stopped in unit 2 we have stopped the vocabulary and grammar and we'll start with the third unit grammar and vocabulary okay so in the third unit vocabulary we have confusables and words with different grammatical function blended words and error spot we have so let's see one by one let's move to the video okay so see confusables already we have seen the confusables or we can say homophones homonyms homographs we have seen already is it or not so that is we call it as confusables so see here they have given english has a lot of commonly confused words a, uh, they either look alike or look and sound alike but have completely different meaning and usage here are some examples from the text okay uh, so see the, the difference so uh, often the people confuse the word that is brought and bought so brought is the past tense for bring bought is the past tense for buy okay so remember that so see uh, brought is a verb past participle of bring example anita had bought a book from the library got it and then bought past participle of buy example lalita had bought a, a new dress last week so see the difference brought bought so make sure that while you pronounce this so you should not say bought so bought mean the entirely the meaning differs you have to say brought anita had brought a book from the library whereas here you should not say brought you should say bought lalita had bought a new dress last week got it then affect affect to have an effect on so the the pet's death affected his master okay so see anything brought about by a cause or agent result example both el nino and la nina are opposite effects of the same phenomenon okay and then let's start with the book back so we'll start with the, actually in the third unit they have given uh, the synonyms and antonyms in that vocabulary session so i'll teach you one by one so uh, they have given the first thing is profession so profession is nothing but career and then sorrowful gloomy decency nobility destiny fate so these are all the synonyms okay and then hijacked commandeered so where we have seen that this word commandeered in the fourth unit is it or not take a possession of something by force and then motivation i repeat take a possession of something by force that is nothing but commandeer and motivation you know very well in encourage uh, sorry encouragement serious severe significant important okay and then go through the lesson and spot the words opposite to the meaning of the following so now we are going to see the opposite okay see rare prevalent primitive primitive means what we can say ரொம்ப பழமையானது வி கேன் சே இன் செகண்ட் ஹேண்ட் அவுட் ஆஃப் டேட் ஸ்டேல் லைக் தட் ஓகே ஸோ ஃபார் தேட் த ஆப்போசிட் வேர்டு சொஃபஸ்டிகேட்டட் ஃபிக்ஷன் ஃபேக்ட் ஃபிக்ஷன் மீன்ஸ் வாட் இட்ஸ் அ ஸ்டோரி ஓகே கட்டுக்கதை அண்ட் வி கேன் சே ஃபேக்ட் ரியல் ஃபியர்ஃபுல் இன்டர்பிரேட் ஓகே அண்ட் தென் பினாய் மேக்லினட் மேக்லினட் மீன்ஸ் வாட் that is fearful and this is fearless maglin and means fearless diffidence confidence and then boredom the opposite for this amusement we can say amusement is nothing but enjoyment criticized criticized means appreciate so this is the opposite and now we can say 
and C. Frame illustrative sentences to distinguish the meaning of the words in the following. So they have given the three confusables. Is it or not? See, see the example. So you should be very, very careful while choosing the confusables. So see here. Career, career, courier. So career means what? We should be careful in choosing our career. My cycle has a career behind the seat. Is it or not? And then I send the parcel through courier. So see the difference. And then patience, patience, patent. Okay, so patience means what? Nurse look after the patients. Geeta is known for her patience, Amedi. And then scientists get patent before they create something new. That means what? Here it's very, very important word. Make a note of it. So uh, patent is nothing but a license or an authority, a government authority. Note it down. Patent means it's nothing but license or a government authority. Next, accident, incident, incidents. My neighbor met with an accident. The roads were sealed off because of something, some major incident. And then there's a, there's a high incidence of malaria in the area. So here, incidence means what? The occurrence, the rate or frequency of disease. Crime or other undesirable thing. Underline and write it. The occurrence, rate or frequency of disease, crime or other undesirable thing. Okay. And then see. Scrapping. It's a very, very important word. See the difference. The scrapping were collected from the lathe. That means what? Here scrapping is nothing but write down action or a sound. So, the sound were collected from the lathe. Got it or not? And, and then, second one. Government is thinking of scrapping the use of particular aircraft. So, here, see the spelling there. Scrapping means only one P. They have used in the first word. And see here, they have uh, used two P, double P. So, scrapping. That means discard or remove. Note down. Discard or remove. And then, the floor needs scrubbing. That you know very well. Scrub means what? A rubber. Okay. And then see fifth one. She accept the new offer. Accept. And then everybody attended the class except Sundar. Except. Okay. Except Sundar. All the guys attended. And then we expect. Okay. We expect to get results on Monday. Okay. Uttakaradu, Ada Tavira, and then Edir Pakaradu. Okay, and then see, lesson, lesson, listen. So, this is the correct pronunciation for the third word, listen. We should be thorough with the lesson before the exam. Okay, and then this medicine will lessen the pain. Okay, and then the last one is, I told you, the correct phonetic script for this is reason that is nothing but wound and then severe severe swear okay so radha suffers from severe stomach ache the trunk of the tree was severed by the woodcutter and then this one is swear that means what the swear is under repair make a note of it set of swear is nothing but a set of pipes and drains to remove waste water and other waste materials. I repeat, set of pipes, drains to remove waste water and other waste materials. Okay? And then see, David raised his hands to join the competition. So, raised. The sun rises in the east. And then, rise is the staple food of South Indians. Got it? And then, quiet, quit, quiet. Note down. See the difference between the phonetic script? Quiet. The teacher asks the students to keep quiet, not quit or not quiet. Not quiet, quiet. So, keep quiet. Okay? So, that, that is the correct translation for that. The teachers ask the students to keep quiet. I saw quite a big snake. So, quite here, quite means what? Mulumaya or Puriya. Okay. I saw quite a big snake. And then he decided to quit the job. Okay. And then 
final, finale, and then fill in. Okay. So see, the painter was giving the final touch. The competitors were getting ready for the finale. She remove, she moves with the fill in grace. That means it comes from the cat family. Okay, and then one more thing they have given in the textbook. This is fill in the blanks with the word given in the bracket. Okay, so see the theoretical place where a main source of amusement. I told you no. So amusement means what? Enjoyment. Okay, and then interpret. So what we have seen in that uh, synonyms and antonyms they have used here. Interpret. Okay, so fearful opposite is interpret like that. The interpret barriers of Spartan army marched into the battle against the powerful enemy. And then agony. The agony of parents finally came to an end when their lost child was found with the help of police. Pain. Okay. Social media has brought about a profound impact on the lives of millennial. And the tires of the car got perforated when the vehicle rolled over the rusted nails scattered on the road. Thomas Alva Edison did not lose his confidence even after facing a, seri a series of experimental failures in his quest to discover tungsten. Many victims of the pipeline exploitation is an oil refinery were left permanently disfigured. And then the old lady found solace in the company of the children in the neighborhood. Got it? And then... See, here they have given it as actually uh, blended words, very, very important. When we combine a two new word, we'll get another word that is blended words. Okay, some words in English are formed by combining elements of two other word in co is called blending words. So here it's entirely different in this unit. See, um, form a phrase, actually they said form a phrase with each other, with each of the following pairs of noun given below. So, so many nouns they have given and we have to make it as a pair. So, so see, fiber tissue, so fibrous tissue, muscle plus pain, muscle, muscular pain, skeleton plus system, skeletal system, nerve plus disorder, nervous disorder, digestion plus enim, digestive enim, and then surgery plus instrument, surgical instruments, agony plus experience, agonizing experience, glory plus victory, glorious victory, fancy plus idea, fanciful idea, emotion plus song, emotional song, sense plus issue, sense plus issue, sensitive issue. Okay, so these are all the book back which they are given the textbook and additional I have given here that is breakfast plus lunch. Breakfast plus lunch, brunch. Smoke plus fog. Smoke plus fog, smog. Motorway plus hotel, motel. Motor plus bike, mobike. Television plus broadcast, telecast. Travel plus catalog, travelog. So international plus police, interpol. Teleprinter plus exchange, telex. And then electro plus execute, electrocute, binary plus digit, bit, motor plus pedal cycle, moped, news plus broadcast, newscast, helicopter plus airport, heliport, documentary plus drama, docudrama, education plus entertainment, edutainment, technology plus wizard, techno wizard. See? And then vegetable plus burger, veggie burger, information plus commercial, informatial, lecture plus demonstration, like them. Flimsy plus miserable, flim miserable. Information technology, infotech. Medical plus care, Medicare. Education plus satellite, educate. Electronic plus mail, email. Higher plus technology, high tech. Picture plus element, pixel. Breathe plus analyzer, breathe analyzer. Camera plus recorder, cam recorder. Fantastic plus fabulous, fantabulous. Transfer plus resistor, trans resistor. Melody plus drama, melodrama. Agriculture plus economy, agronomy. Got it? And see, here they have given words with different grammatical function. That is, uh, they will give one word. For example, tear. Okay, so you have make it into, uh, tear means what? The tears rolled up in my eyes. That means what? That is tear, kanneer. And then, don't tear your paper. 
got it wrong so, so this is a difference so the particular word is used as noun verb adjective like that so see amusement is a noun you know very well and if you want to change it into verb so we'll use amuse adjective means amusing adverb amusingly ly means adverb like that appreciation appreciate appreciative appreciably success succeed successful successfully pride pride proud proudly hope hope hopeful hopefully see how beautifully they have given and then the error spot is which is very 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 important so see uh, students often lose your marks in error spot so my opinion is if you want to get full marks in your error spot session you just uh, so then and there you have to read all sort of grammar rules and usages the tricks so that will be helpful for your error spot so some of the students are just mugging and uh, by hearting the error spot it's very very wrong so what are all the things your uh, the steps and, and the usage the tricks and the meanings which you are i mean um, the usage which you are learning in that grammar so that will be helpful for your uh, error spot okay so make sure that in our material uh, we have given all sort of rules for error spot so just you read well okay so see here they have given my grandfather is well known in the village for his well known deeds we should not say well known deeds we have to say noble deeds and then i had evening meal so we won't say evening meal we have to say dinner so uh, here one more confusion is there so what is the difference between supper and dinner so see the example i had my dinner in a restaurant near my office so where he had his dinner in the restaurants so for example if we go out okay if we go out late night or in okay so we have to say it is dinner for example if you are having the same thing at home so we have to say supper okay when you go out for your meal i mean evening meal or night meal we have to say dinner whereas the same thing which you follow routinely in your home okay so we have to say supper okay if uh, the thing in example the restaurant is not there means what i we have to use we have to use supper i had my supper uh, in my home like that okay got it or not but here the opt word is dinner because they have given i had my dash in a restaurant so he goes out okay so we have to use dinner and see the boss had full confidence on his manager for successful competition that means what the boss had full confidence in his manager for successful competition of the thing. okay and then see here after the complete uh, complicated surgery the patient hoped of we should not say hoped of we should say hope for often i think uh, you might have learned this uh, let us hope for the best so hope is a particular word the word is uh, commanded by for okay for preposition hope for is a correct preposition used in uh, with the help i mean uh, with hope okay so hope for complete recovery and then suffering with we should not say suffering from and then in spite of his poverty and uh, set setbacks he was able to launch his dream career so see so c a r r what we have seen at the first c a r r e e r is career choosing the career if you use c a r r i e r that means what tiffin career like that tiffin career or seed career like that okay so hope you have enjoyed this vocabulary session okay i'll meet you in the next class with third unit grammar part that is active and passive voice which is very very important presented by n ramesh kumar hod department of english shivadhi bharathi metric higher secondary school sakramalayam namakkal thank you students